this 100% free AI SEO Chrome extension has gone from zero users in July to over 6,000 at the time of recording. In this video, I'm going to show you the just released version 1.7 that includes the most requested functionality improvements, that is multi-language support and also the ability to export the SEO strategy to a spreadsheet perfectly every time. Plus, I'm going to show you an easy hack to convert any AI SEO content to undetectable AI content. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Subscribers to the channel have a passion for SEO and staying ahead of the curve. Alrighty, just quickly, let's install the extension just in case you're not sure how to do that. The easiest way is head to this site here, getseotools.io, scroll down a bit, click on this one here, AI SEO Assistant, and you're good to go. The other way to do it is, depending on which browser you're using, go to the extensions section. So in Brave, I just go here and go to extensions, and then I can click on find them in the web store. Once you're here, just type in AI SEO, and you'll find it's the very first one here. It says featured. We're going to add to Brave. Yours might say add to Chrome or whatever browser you are using. So I'll hit add to Brave. Now it's going to ask you here to add the extension. If you don't click this, it's not going to work. So we just click add the extension. It's successfully installed. Now to use it, we need to open up either ChatGPT or Claude. We just go over to ChatGPT and then on our extensions, we just want to pin it to the browser. And now you can see you've got this little orange icon, AI SEO Assistant has access to the site. Now if I do a quick refresh, you can now see the extension is active. We have this SEO strategy, SEO blog, and outrank. If we want to hide it for now, we can just toggle it this way. All right, so we're all installed, activated, and now we can generate some content. Okay, so first I'm going to generate an SEO strategy. We need this so I can show you how to export it to a spreadsheet perfectly every time. So to do this, very easy and it's very powerful. Just click on SEO strategy. We'll enter in a keyword. I'll go with Lightbox Photography. We will go for five, which is the maximum here. This is the variations of our keyword key phrase. You'll see this output in a moment. And the big update for this release of the tool is the addition of the extra languages. So for this example, I'll just stick with English and we'll hit submit. So this is the strategy that the AI has generated for us. We have five columns, we've got keyword cluster, the keyword, the search intent, the title, and the meta description. Alrighty, so if you've ever tried to copy this table that comes out of this tool and put it into a spreadsheet, you may have ran into problems due to how it inconsistently pastes the data. Sometimes it comes out okay, and sometimes it comes out like all over the shop. But anyway, I'm gonna show you how to do it perfect every time. Let's just scroll down to the bottom. When you get down here, you're gonna notice the copy button. So let's just press it. Now I'm gonna put this into a Google Sheet. Just go over to your Google Sheet. In this case, I'm just gonna press Control V and it's gonna paste it. And you can see all the data is actually in column A. So column A is highlighted. We're gonna fix this just in a couple of clicks. Go to data and then click on split text into columns. And rather than detect automatically, I'm gonna select custom. And as soon as I put the pipe symbol in, it's going to fix it. And there you go. The data is now perfectly in the five columns. All right, so the next step is we're going to generate an AI blog, and then we're going to convert that AI blog into undetectable AI SEO content. Let's just pick one of these blog titles. I'll go with this one here, how a light box can improve your product photo. So I'll just copy this one. Back over in chat GPT, I'm just going to click on SEO blog and I'll paste that one in. We'll do it in a casual tone. We'll stick with English and submit this. So now we're going to get approximately a thousand word blog article that's SEO optimized for, for our given blog title. All right, so we have our blog article. I'm going to take a copy of this and I'm going to put it into an AI detection tool and show you what the what it says about our content. Alrighty, so I'm just copying the article here. Now I'm heading over to this site here. It's called Undetectable AI. The reason I'm using it is because it gives you a AI detection likelihood across a number of these sort of well respected AI detection tools. I'm just going to paste this in here and then hit check for AI. So it's still in the check and we'll see what it says. It's pretty much saying this is AI generated. A couple of them are 
not detecting it, but you know, 80% say it is. So let's say it is. All right, now, how can we modify this text really quick and really easily to pass AI detection? Now I'm going to show you how to do that. So the tool we're going to be using to convert our AI content to undetectable AI is Sigma SEO. Let's see how it works using the bypass tool. I'm all logged in here and I've gone to this one here. It's called the bypass tool. And what this allows you to do is paste text in that's been generated elsewhere and then convert it to undetectable AI. So let's just scroll down the bottom first and I'll just paste in our article that ChatGPT generated for us. And I've entered in the, the title of our article and you've got a whole bunch of parameters that you can update, such as language, the tone, the audience, uh, the AI detection avoidance level will stay with standard, the perspective, the domain. So we might put in here technology, for instance, complexity level will stay with moderate and we'll go for plain text. We'll include the FAQ and we'll also generate additional meta suggestions. So, so we'll submit this and get a rewrite. Alrighty, so that has done the rewrite for us. We can just hit copy, take a copy of our revised article. You can see down here in these separate containers, we've got FAQ and meta suggestions as well if you need them. So now we'll just go back to AI Detector, copy that article. We're just going to clear the previous one we had. So hit clear here. I'll just paste in the rewrite and we'll just check it. And there you go. Human written, green ticks all the way. And that is the power of Sigma SEO. Quite handy. I hope you got some value from this video. If you did, consider giving it a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you in the next one.